Welcome everyone. To access deleted WhatsApp messages on your iPhone, we will need to use third party recovery software. The software is free to use. You can view the deleted messages for free, but to export them to your computer, you will need to pay money. So keep that one in mind, but you can still view the messages for free. There is also no 100% success rate. Okay, so this may not work. It depends on how many files have been written to the iPhone since you deleted the messages. So let's move to the computer and I'm gonna show you the next steps. Let's go to the next steps. So the software we want to use is the EaseUS data recovery software. So make sure you select for iOS. If I don't have a link in the description, you have to go to this website you see on screen because uh, I may forget to add the link. And so we have the Windows, the free, and the free Mac version. So you can scan all the files, see what's available. And if there is what you need, you may need to buy the Pro Edition. You may be able to get away with a free trial, but I cannot guarantee that the free trial will recover everything. So let's download the version for our operating system. And you can see it's going to download. And once the file is downloaded on the Mac, we just drag and drop the app into our applications folder like this. On Windows, there'll be some on-screen instructions you need to follow. And once we've done this, we just need to open up the EaseUS Mobi Saver. And you can see this prompt, just click on open and the EaseUS Mobi Saver will now open up. So the next step is we will need to connect our iPhone to the computer. So you will need the charging cable and you will need to connect to the computer. So I'm gonna do that one now. Once the iPhone is connected, you see on the EaseUS, it wants us to unlock the phone. So just bring your iPhone to the home screen and then tap on the trust message and then we can see our device is connected and we can click on start to recover. So let's click on start. Now it is asking what type of data we would like to recover. So if you just select tool, everything will be selected, but you can just select the stuff you want. Uh, once the scanning has completed, you can see everything here. So under third party apps, you can see no data in the WhatsApp section. Uh, that's because I don't use WhatsApp, I just had it installed. But if you do, you should see all of your communications. And at the top here, if you click this, you can filter by deleted files. So you can see your deleted WhatsApp messages. Again, if you've written too many files to the iPhone since, uh, you know, you deleted the WhatsApp message, it may not show up here. But if I go to, let's say, the, the contacts, you can see... It does recover some deleted stuff. See 21 deleted contacts. And once you want to export something, just select it and then click on recover to PC here. I believe you can export some stuff for free, but if you export too much, it will charge you money. And of course you do have the WhatsApp attachment section. If you want to look at some deleted attachments as well. And with that being said, if you would like to help support the channel, please do check the description. Bye-bye.